Oh, what's happening, my people? This is your boy Chance Jalavit, aka Smooth, back with another video. So, today, what we're gonna be talking about is <laughs> Jordan 11 Varsity Reds. So, this right here is gonna be one of my how to style videos. And who am I to tell you how to style something? Am I the style guru or anything? No, but do, do I think I dress? I dress, I dress decent, man. I get a little compliments in real life and shit. Uh, a lot of the sneakers YouTubers and something, they dress like trash. I don't care. You can you get a, a thousand dollar ball main or whatever. If the shit ugly, the shit is ugly. A lot of people be dressed. And anyways, so let's get into this and talk about this upcoming shoe, this cherry varsity red, whatever they want to call them, and put a few, put together a few little looks or whatever. Well. Other people have put together some looks. I'm going to talk about them at the end of the video. I'm going to show some of my little looks for y'all to talk about them. Because I didn't write, like, really come down with it or anything. But did a little something. A little color. Coordinating. Coordinating. Now, well, the secret is you got to coordinate. Uh huh. Most people don't coordinate. So you got to coordinate. Anyways, I. First look right here. Click, click. Is Atlanta Braves vibes on, man. Like, if you're going to the Atlanta. A Braves game or something, it's cool. Got uh, the blue jean jacket on, man. Navy blue, very dark indigo blue uh, jeans or whatever. I wouldn't suggest wearing some jeans like that, man. Jeans that color, they usually kind of bleed. So shit, whenever he take them, them off, man, they, they might have like some blue around him. He might have fucked his shoes up. But anyway, this is a Alright, this alright, man. Like some fan gear type stuff. It's like, uh, uh, uh. as far as I like, outfit or something, like, uh, uh. I'm not really like a athletic. F I, I I love athletics and shit like that, but like as far as like an outfit, like just throwing, getting, uh, uh. back in nine nine and two thousand or something. Anyway, uh, so next look right here, homeboy, coming with the with the super skinnies, uh, bubble jacket. It has that uh, what's the? I'm trying to think of the color palette because I remember they had a bunch of Jordans that came out in those colors, like the the Jordan sixes and stuff. And, uh, I don't want to say indigo; it's not indigo, no. but anyways. So got the color changing type type look to them. It's like I like like a plain look, like a plain all black look or something. The jeans are like a little more skinnier than I would wear, but I do like a tapered jean with with the shoes because you can see the shoe. And stuff, man. It's like, it's cool. Just like an old Bryson Tiller type look back in the days or something, man. So it's, it's all right. Look number three. This right here, this is like, if you wearing this like as an outfit, like I'm, nah, nah. If you like, I'm killing it. I'm killing it. No, no. This some old head shit. Just, this just some, I went to uh, Hibbits and bought the Jordan section type stuff and like, Nah, this is like if you go into the grocery store or something like that. You just want, I'm like, I need something red to throw on. I'm gonna throw on these cherry 11s. Cool, cool, man. But if if I'm talking in terms of outfit, like fashion, this ain't it. Like if you if you talking in those terms, so that's the only reason why I'm talking about like like it's different between like just putting something on and outfit, like your your uh purpose for wearing it or something so anyways look number four right here this right here it has some good elements to it like i like the the, the coat and stuff man like that old school that bulls is like yeah probably got a bulls hat on you can't really tell i'm like yeah them jeans dog they don't fit do body man like uh if i was like a stylist for them or something like Dog, you you is a little too skinny for for your body type and like is messing up. You look like the Kool Aid Man or something, man. Like one of them cartoon characters where it's like the big body getting a little bitty legs. Like you need something more age appropriate, more size appropriate. Like look number where I'm going to number five. Like see, he needs some jeans like that. Like this is an older gentleman. You could tell he probably a teacher or something. Like he the fly teacher. Like. As far as like his age, what he is doing with them and stuff, that is fly. Like if he going to the club, he's out somewhere or something, 
Well, then I wouldn't say this necessarily fly. But as far as like him, he probably a teacher or something, his students, like they walk, oh, teach got the brand new varsity, ooh, like, that's, that's fly. It's, it's, certain things can work in certain environments and won't work in other environments. But like as far as the environment he in, like his size, like the, the jeans and stuff, like homeboy should have wore, homeboy in the previous look should have wore some jeans like that. Like not super skinny or something, just like a slight taper, like like a just a regular jean. Like them on his body type just don't work. But anyways, who am I? Who am I? This right here, the hypermodel, uh Marissa or something, but she does YouTube and stuff. That's the only reason why I'm mentioning her stuff, cause if you're a YouTuber, you want your stuff out there. So hypermodel, if you want to check out her YouTube channel and stuff. And this right here, she got that, that all cream type look. I'm not mad at it. The only thing throws it off is like, it's that all cream look, but the shoe is like very much white. So it's, it's kind of like, I don't know, cream and white kind of throws off a little bit. Like a, just a, a little tad bit. It's like, mm, may I would say maybe like uh, the lost and found ones because they got more of that age look on them. So it's kind of like, goes with it but that, that all white against that cream it's kind of like uh, it's not bad but it's just like throws it off just a little tad bit next one right here old old i want to say old school he probably like my age or whatever man like i'm i'm <laughs> but anyways we, we probably the same age in the same age range and i like this like is it look like like it would it would it uh, I can't, I can't, I can't read it right now. It's kind of small on my screen. But anyways, like, uh, so it's, it's college. He might be back to the campus or whatever. Might be visiting or might just might go to a football game or something. Like this right here, this right there, nice. That's right there is a, is a nice look. Even I usually don't really like uh, like blue with them or something. But like got some red red pop on there and stuff, man. The jeans size appropriate, man, for his age, man. He ain't trying to do too much. Like, I, I like the look. I like the look. And then he, then he got he got the braids and stuff. So he is like, I'm older, but I'm still fly. I, I like this. I like this. This next look right here, like, I like a lot of the color palettes to it. Like, uh, the khaki type pants. I, I like I like khaki with a lot of stuff. And I'm not mad at, at the khaki with these shoes right here. The red, the red hoodie. I like that. I'm not too crazy about the flannel over over it. Maybe a different color flannel or something. I don't know. Or maybe if you had like a jean jacket over the top, I think I would like that a little bit more. This color, this flannel right there is kind of like, uh, like maybe maybe if you had like a black and red flannel with a white hoodie underneath or something in that pattern. But it's cool. It's cool. Look bad. It's cool. I ain't mad at it. Uh. This look right here, this is the hypermodel. I'm not, I'm not necessarily too crazy about this one either. Like the color palettes and stuff, like I could, I would, I would say like maybe uh, like the, the flu game twelves or something like be more appropriate with this, or uh, uh, something like like against those uh, against that leather, that pleather and pleather pants. I would say maybe like a heel. Like, like in the females or something, I say maybe like a heel or a boot or something, rather than the Varsity 11s. Like, that's, that's my thoughts and opinions, man. Like, she flyer than me, so she know what she doing. But I would, I would, I would say a heel or a boot for that fit right there in those pants and stuff. But, the color palette, color palette cool. Uh, the last one, and I, I'm giving her her props. This is my favorite look out of the, the people. And she got that all tan look, that all khaki look, look right there. Like, the cream kind of throws it off. But, like, the little darker when it goes into, like, the uh, the tannish type colors. Like, that like that, uh, fairer guy type color. You know, they had, they throw a lot of oatmeal type colors. That doesn't bother me with against white. I don't know. That's just my eye palette. Like, if it's, if it's like, just a one shade off of white, say it, don't spray it. If it's one shade off of white. It throws it off a little bit, but when it's like a few shades, like then it's kind of like okay, now it makes it pop. And I like the little the red uh, tam and stuff, the red hat. I like that that little 
pop of color. So this is my favorite look out of the people. So now we're going to get into my looks, man. So this is my first look. And this is like some free stuff I had. Like I do like a collaboration with companies here and then. This comes from Koi. And I had this on deck. And I'm like, uh, yeah, let me let me break this out. Let me break this out, man. So it, it's kind of like a futuristic look, like a streetwear type look. I think streetwear is starting to die down a little bit. But like, I just wanted to throw something out there crazy. Just something wow. And like the shirt, not not super crazy. The pants are very much crazy. So it's like, either you're going to think this is a super fly or you're going to think this nigga doing too much. So this is like on the fence. It depends on what you like. So I don't know what to think about this look. It's like, as far as color palettes, I think it, it goes with the color. But it's like, is is what what you what you like whatever. Anyways, so my next look right here is more simplistic. This right here, this is a crazy winter time, especially for down here. Like, it's still hot. So I threw through on a hoodie that was like color appropriate and stuff, man. Some little shorts. It's not necessarily hoochie daddy ish, but it's like the white against the uh gets the hoodie and stuff. I like the shorts and hoodie look. And so this right here is just like a casual look or whatever. Like, not necessarily an outfit, but it's it's cool enough to for you to wear it for kind of be an outfit type type thing, man. Like if you're going to a basketball game or something like that, or you just chilling or whatever. I like the look. I I like the color palettes and stuff. Not necessarily the blue on the sleeve, but I, I like it with with that hoodie, man. Hey, I paid for it. And this last one right here, simplistic look, man. Uh, threw on a hat just for a little bit of color pop, but necessarily probably wouldn't have wore the hat because I got fresh braids and stuff. But anyways, got the Mary J. Blige shirt, got that from Tar Tar J. Uh, I think the the pants are champs. I think I got them from champs for a while back. But just some camo t-shirt and just showing you that you don't have to wear like red and go out like to match the colors and stuff. Like I could have took the hat off, I just threw the hat on. But uh, yeah. That's the last look, man. So that is my hottest style video of the Cherry 11s. Whenever I wear them, I'm probably going to go a whole different way with them. But that's the first things popped into my mind. I just grab some clothes real quick and uh, show people looks. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe. Go be the greatest and the most hated man. I'm about to go shoot basketball. Peace.